Hey guys, welcome back to the House of Wrinkles, bringing you the how-to for English Bulldogs. And today's topic is going to be what to expect when you're thinking about adding an English Bulldog to your family. So stay tuned. when you're thinking about adding an English Bulldog to your family. And why not? Because these things are so cute and wrinkly and we just love them. We have five and um, the first thing to know is cost. And we did an extensive video on cost of English Bulldogs and we'll link a uh, that video in the description below. Number two is vet bills. You're gonna accrue vet bills with an English Bulldog for sure. The life expectancy of an English Bulldog is eight to 10 years. In order to achieve that, it's important that you keep their health checks and their vaccinations up to date. English Bulldogs do have allergies and heart problems, but thankfully they did not make the top 10 list of breeds that have that problem. Number three is stubbornness. English Bulldogs are known first and foremost for their stubbornness. So it can be a little bit challenging when trying to train them, either potty training or otherwise. Uh, now it is hit or miss with one of ours. Uh, he was trained, completely trained at 10 weeks old. But as a rule of thumb, they are a little harder to train. The fourth thing to know is English Bulldogs are known for their laziness. They are not active dogs. So they don't require a lot of um, exercise. In fact, heavy exercise is not good for them. Which leads us to number five. That is, English Bulldogs are strictly indoor dogs. Their squish face and their body structure is not made for the heat or extreme temperatures. In fact, English Bulldogs have even been known to have heat exhaustion in only 70 degree weather. I know some breeders do keep their dogs outside in kennels, but we do not recommend that at all. Number six is drooling. As you can tell, <laughs> these guys drool a lot. <laughs> so expect cleanup. seven is shedding. English Bulldogs do shed a lot. So if you're looking for a dog breed that doesn't shed, English Bulldogs probably not for you. We do have a video on how to cut down on shedding and it will be linked in the description below. Also, there will be an Amazon link to the de-shedding tool that we use. Number nine is grooming. You do have to keep their ears and their wrinkle folds clean frequently. And finally, number 10 on our list is these guys are the best, in our opinion. They're the most lovable, loyal companions you could ever have. But I just want to remind everybody that's thinking about adopting any pet, that it is a huge responsibility. It's not something that's easy. It does take work. So stay dedicated, 
and give your pet a loving home.